g square plus 6g plus 13 is equal to 0 part number 2 2 plus 2 divides g plus g is equal to 2 part number 3 2 g square plus 15 is equal to 4 g so let's start part number 1 g square plus 6g plus 13 equal to 0 so next g square plus 6 g plus 9 plus 4 9 plus 4 is equal to 13 so which is equal to 0 g plus 3 whole square so g square plus 6 g plus 9 is the square of g plus 3 whole square plus 4 equal to 0 so z plus 3 whole square minus into minus 1 into 4 equal to 0 so multiply minus into minus plus so z plus 3 whole square minus into minus 1 is equal to iota square so iota square 2 square is equal to 4 equal to 0 so z plus 3 whole square minus into 2 iota whole square which is equal to 0 so next z plus 3 whole square minus into 2 iota whole square can also be written in the form of z plus 3 minus 2 iota into z plus 3 plus 2 iota equal to 0 so next z plus 3 minus 2 iota equal to 0 and z plus 3 plus 2 iota equal to 0 so z Taking a minus z is equal to 3 minus 3 plus 2. So next z is equal to minus 3 into minus 2 iota z is equal to minus 3 plus 2 iota z is equal to minus 3 minus 2 iota can also be written in the form of z is equal to minus 3 plus minus 2 iota which is the required solution next part number 2 part number 2 that is 2 divides z plus z is equal to 2. So next 2 plus z multiply z multiply z, z square is equal to z multiply 2 2 z. So next z square minus 2z plus 2 equal to 0 so z square minus 2z plus 1 plus 1 equal to 0 so next z square minus 2z plus 1 can also be written in the form of z minus 1 or square plus 1 equal to 0 so next z minus 1 whole square minus into minus 1 
equal to 0. So next, z minus 1 whole square minus into minus 1 is equal to eta square which is equal to 0. So z minus 1 minus iota into z minus 1 plus iota equal to 0. So next z minus 1 minus iota equal to 0. z minus 1 plus iota equal to 0. So next z minus minus common so 1 plus iota equal to 0 z minus common into 1 minus iota equal to 0 so next z is equal to 1 plus iota z is equal to 1 minus iota z is equal to 1 plus iota and z is equal to 1 minus iota can also be written in the form of z is equal to 1 plus minus iota which is the required solution. Next, part number 3. Part number 3 that is 2z square plus 15 is equal to 4z. So next, dividing 2 on both sides. So z square plus 15 divide 2 is equal to 4. z divide 2. So 2, 2 times 4 z square plus 15 divided by 2 is equal to 2 z so next z square minus 2 z is equal to minus 15 divided by 2 z square minus 2 z is equal to minus 15 divided by 2 so to complete this square, adding 1 on both sides, z square minus 2, z plus 1 is equal to 1 minus 15 divided 2. So next, z square minus 2, z plus 1 is the square of z minus 1 whole square, which is equal to taking LCM 2. So 2, 2, 1 times 2 minus 2 1 times 2 so 15 z minus 1 all square is equal to 2 minus 15 is equal to minus 13 divided by 2 so next taking square root on both sides z minus 1 all square square root is equal to minus 13 divided by 2 all square root so square square root cancel z minus 1 is equal to 13 under root 13 divided by 2 into minus 1 under root of minus 1. So next, z minus 1 is equal to under root of 13 divided by under root of 2. Under root of minus 1 is equal to iota. So z minus 1 is equal to iota under root 13 divided by 2. So z is equal to 1 plus iota under root 13 divided by 2 which is the required solution if you like my lecture then please subscribe share like and press bell icon for latest update on my youtube channel thanks for watching my youtube lecture okay allah hafiz